It's the block, 96.3 in Greenville, 104.5 in Sparkle City. I've got Black Zach from DME, from Columbia, the Met. Welcome to the block. What it do, what it do. Trapper of the year. Who need gas, I got a feel. <laughs> yeah, yeah, um, that's how you do it. You're, you're on these, this, this promo tour. That's how you do it. Yeah, yeah, you got to work hard. Ain't got to have yeah, so uh, tell me about this rise. How does it feel to be in another city at another radio station outside your home metro as you on this promo tour and you're not signed, I understand. We'll get to that. Yeah, it, it's a blessing. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's, Lecrae. Yeah, it's, it's, fun. it's fun to do what you, you know, what you love to do and get some benefits from it at the end of the day. So it, it was, it's a hard grind. You know, you got to work hard, but... We have fun with that any day too. Yeah, this song, Trap of the Year, how long have you been working it? I mean, we've been working it. I, I did it a minute ago. We've been working it for like a few months now. Okay. I, mean, I did it a long time ago, but that was just the one like the streets gravitated to. That was the one they wanted, so that's what been going crazy. I asked you that question for a reason. We have artists, you know, who break songs. I, yeah. I, I host on Sunday every Sunday, and you know, I guess because the month changes, they feel they need to give you a new song. But that might not be, you know what I'm saying, the one that's popping. Exactly. This, and, and you said the, the streets were made this song your priority, right? Yeah, I like I like to just drop the music and let the, let the people decide on what they like, like what they want to push, you feel know what I'm saying, what they like, and, 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 and it's just the, that's, that's my form. I just like dropping the music, and the people, I let the people pick, and that's the one they pick. Okay. Who is Black Zach? To those that don't know your music, your your label, DME, or the, the summer of the re-up, the mixtape that's dropping just now. Okay, I'm not the one from Green. <laughs> not the one from Fountain. <laughs> His brother's not John John, yeah. but it's okay though. But yeah. but to get to know the music, I, I say that because your buzz has brought you in the studio where I work with Black Zach. So that's why I give you that respect. Yeah, your buzz is strong enough that I got to make the distinction. Shout out uh, to the other Black Zach. Bro. I'm the one out of Columbia, South Carolina, out of Bluff Road. That's where I'm. That's where my stuff is going. That's my hood. You know, I'm a hustler. I just like to, I, I love music. I like to get money, I love it, you know. Make sure my people straight, make sure my clients straight, man. That's what I do. Okay. Dirty Money on the T, SMG. That's your own label? That's us, yeah. Yeah, we don't need, we, you know, we got major money. We ain't worried about my labels. <laughs> <laughs> but you're on, you're on that, that label type of tour. Yeah, that's what we're doing. <laughs> With our budget. We got our own budget. Yeah, okay. Well, that's that's how you do it. Now, the summer, the re-up, what's that about? I mean, that's just the second part of I did the first one with uh, DJ Bigger Rankin. Yeah, I heard. Yeah, Lucci. Yeah. Uh, Bigger Rankin is actually with uh, a DJ here in Greenville, the upstate, uh, DJ G-Co. He's in the cool. Shout out G-Co. He's a cool running DJ. Yeah. Bigger Rankin's people. Yeah, yeah Bigger Rankin, that's, that's an OG, man. He always takes me into motivation and stuff. You know what I'm saying? But I linked up with him on the first one. And it was just, we got a stupid buzz from it. And then we was approaching the summer again. I dropped that last summer. We was approaching the summer again. So I was like, we might as well do a real. And I didn't want to call it Reloaded. So I was like, let's just do it for the streets. Let's call it the real. Okay. Okay. How do we find Black Zach on social media? How do we do it? You can find me on social media at Black Zach DME, B L A C C Z A C C DME. And make sure you get some of my merchandise. On my website, www.blackzack.com. I got stupid gear for the women's and the men. Okay. Now, what would you say to the, these artists that, that, that work at District and Highlands and this is neighborhoods out here, like the Met where you're at, you know, um, the Bluff, like you mentioned. What would you say to the artists down here? Yeah. I would say to them, like, you got to be DME. And when I say DME, you got to be dedicated, motivated every day. You got to know you, what you want. And, and just stay consistent. You gotta make people believe. Like you just gotta believe in yourself and stay consistent. Like it's gonna be a long grind, but you just gotta believe in yourself and keep going. Okay. And uh, back to that, that the record picking. How do you pick the the, the song that that people go? Because I, I I mean I host the show. I have 470 songs. I've been doing a local independent music show every Sunday since July, January 24th, 2016. It's every Sunday, about 12 songs. So I have about 470 songs now. Here we are into June 2017. You know, uh, what would you say to artists? Because, you know, they, they send me songs. And I mean, I'm not going to I'm not gonna hate, I'm going to play it. But I the song, I just you asked me about some artists that have popped here. Artists like Mont Fu. Shut up. Artists like Daze Carter. Artists like Young Rush. They have street cred, they have buzz, the songs, 
you can pull away, people sing like like did we play them all week long. That part, you see, <laughs> you know, in the bedroom, in the dark room, in the dark room. Actually, I, I was quoting a song at, at the mailbox, at the mailbox. <laughs> that was my introduction to Scully. Reach out the That's what I'm saying. It's not, it's not, there's not a lot of traffic at the mailbox. See? <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I know I, these, these artists, rest in peace, Jug Money. Rest in peace, Cody Boy. He's another artist. He's gone, but man, his, his music was big. Um, a wall uh, is it, he's he's still here. He was on a song with with Cody. Uh, you have Quez who died in the car wreck. I run I run with Cody that crashed in Atlanta J January 18th. Um, Lottie was on the record with Quez. Thirty on me now. Yeah. Lottie's it's Lottie's time. You see my point? There's, there's a lot of involvement going on with this local music scene, but there are a lot of people with that buzz. And I see the next level with you because you're, you're here. You're here. My boss told me I had to interview you. Shout out to the boss. Hey, that part. <laughs> but I'm just saying, he don't tell me to do nothing unless there's some facts, stats, buzz behind it. So I got to give you that respect and credit, Black Zach. Trap of the year. Seriously, the buzz you have is like making making that story as Trap of the Year. We could check back in January, like, yeah, in the summer. Yeah, he went up to the block with JJ and did an interview, and, and, and he was going around the area, Fayetteville, all these, that's how you, yeah. Exactly. And I want to let everybody know, like, when I say that I'm the Trap of the Year, you don't necessarily got to be in the streets. Like, for instance, right now, I'm in your trap. So you the trap of the year right now. I'm in your trap. So you don't necessarily got to be in the streets. Whatever you're doing, at your, whatever your workplace is, when you're traveling, you're trapped for the year, you're the best at it. So what if I got 2016 DJ Plug of the Year Award from the uh, the awards with Paul Davis? DJ Plug of the Year, a.k.a. Trap of the Year. I appreciate that. Black Zach, and we'll drop that record, see how it goes. Trap of the Year. Who's you guess I got to feel? I'm the trap of the year. I'm the trap of the year. I'm the trap of the year. Nigga know just what it do. Take a 448 and I made it disappear. Quarter